NFL on EA Sports, and we are at Highmark Stadium in upstate New York. Today, we're set for a good AFC matchup between the Indianapolis Colts and the Buffalo Bills. And we are underway in Buffalo. And this will be a touchback as that sails over the end line. Carry by Taylor to start the drive. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. Yeah, I don't know if it's exactly a win-win, but if you're on offense, you'll take that kind of a run, all right? It was kind of stacked up, found a little bit of yardage, and frankly, they're pretty close to staying on schedule on offense. The playbook is still open for the coordinator. On second and seven, Ryan. This will be taken in by Michael Pittman. And they're able to get this one across the 35. 11 yards for number 11. This has to go down as one of the simpler routes in the playbook, but oh so effective. Nice completion there. Keeps the sticks moving. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Running straight ahead, Taylor. And he's going to take this ahead for right around three yards, but no more than that. Second down. Well, that's just a pile of bodies there, and that's when you kind of find out who's a tough guy, right? Who can stand up and make a play? It was only a three-yard run, but for both sides, they had to walk away from that field. I'm like, okay, I can stand up when the going gets tough in here. And the last run got three. Now here's second and seven. the play fake. Here's Ryan. And this will be swung out wide for Taylor. And he'll get up near the 45. They'll spot it at the 44. So the completion good for just three. And now it's third and four. The defense is ready for the back to leak out and even had a second player waiting to double him up. If you're going to commit to doubling a back, you better prevent a completion, but give him credit. Extra determination, extra effort, turn it into a successful play. And able to pick up the first across midfield to the 47. It's a nine-yard gain, and it'll keep the drive moving. It's opening drive, third down. They go with a slant. It works. And I'm wondering when the league's going to figure it out because everyone throws it on third down. You expect pressure, so you want the ball in the hands of the quarterback quickly. It's a three-step route ordinarily, and you're throwing it where you see the receiver breaking towards you. So it's an inside route. Everyone likes it, and it's executed very well. Tremaine Edmonds there to bring him down. That's a really nice job by them picking up the run blitz and detecting it and blocking it and turning it into a nice run. And a lot of times you think if you blitz a running play, you're going to smother it. But a lot of the blitzers, they come in a little bit high. They don't have great leverage, and they're easily blocked and turned to the side. They follow up the gain of five by only getting one there on second down. And the big fella stuffed that one up in a big way. I think doubling him has to be a priority because you can't move up to the next level if you don't take care of him first. And on third and five, this will be the eighth play of the drive. Here's Ryan. And he fires one that's intercepted. And the Bills are going to get possession here as they force the opening drive turnover. Offensively, a far from ideal start there with a pick on the opening drive. Yeah, not exactly what they were looking for. We know that. That's pretty obvious. The beauty, though, is it's happening early. If they don't panic, they don't compound this problem, they've got a long way to go and a chance to get back in it. And he is going to lose yardage here. Not what they had in mind there. That's going to go as a loss of four.
To throw again on second down. Allen steps away to his left. This one into the hands of Crowder downfield. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the 30. A gain there of 30 big ones. I know we love our jobs, and pretty much any play we see, we're pretty you know, excited about. The big players, let's face it, that's what we absolutely live for. How about that one? That was great. And what our camera missed was the fist pump from the sideline after that catch. They're fired out. That's a big game. No score after one on EA Sports. So now then, the big play has him all the way inside the 30 now, first and 10. Now Allen. And that is caught. Touchdown, Buffalo. Jamison Crowder. 28 yards, and the Bills post the first points of the ball game as they take the lead here in this second quarter. Extra point by Bass, up and good, and that makes the score 7-0. unit is out on the field and they will send this one away and a short kick taking it about the 16 and yeah, they'll be set up pretty nicely here as they have it up to the 35 yard line The Colts come to the line ready to start their next drive. As the offense comes out here, Charles, remember they threw the interception last time out, but they were moving the football down the field. Looked like they were going to have a sustained drive that ended in points, but then the pick ensued. And because of that, there's no way you can call the last drive a success. Yes, there are things to build on because they found some play calls at work. Now they've got to build another drive and find a way to avoid the turnover the play did on the last one. So after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. Here's Ryan. That is caught. Michael Pittman with it. And able to rip off a big chunk of yardage before being dropped inside the 40. That one good for 26 and a first down. Well, that certainly has to feel good. It's not all the time that the play caller should get all the credit. Sometimes I think in the huddle, the quarterback just says, hey, who's going to make a play for me? I just need something right here. And the end result there, nice first down. Drive keeps moving. And he still has yet to get on track in this first half as they're going to stop him behind the line. I have a feeling they'll stay committed to running the football, especially on the early downs. They just haven't had a whole lot of success just yet. Now they contend with a second and 12 after the loss. Out of the gun, it's Ryan. Hits his target to tight end Mo Alley Cox. And this winds up a pickup of two, maybe two and a half to about the 39. Oh, it's time to give a little credit there to the defense. They played that very well because it was a drag route. And he ran a little shallower than normal as he worked straight across the field. He was hoping he'd get lost behind the defensive line. But once he made the catch, nowhere to turn up field and gain any yardage. An extra defensive back here for the Bills on third down.
From the gun, it's Ryan. He'll find Paris Campbell. That's complete. And he's taken down, but not before reaching the 10-yard line. That gain on third down, good for 28. And this has been a nice answer to the touchdown drive against them a few minutes ago because they've come out and reestablished the tempo. A nice throw there, and they're putting together a very strong drive as a response. So not quite a first and goal. It's first and 10 from the 10. Ryan. And it's intercepted at the goal line. And the Bills are going to take possession here as they've got it at their own four-yard line. CD, when he went to throw that, I'm not sure if he just didn't see where the defense was or whatever the case. Not the throw you're looking for on first and goal. Not at all because, look, let's face it, that close to the goal line, if you throw an interception, it's going to hurt on any down. But really, the only down you can kind of live with is if you do it on fourth down. The first three, if you don't have it wide open, just get rid of it. Make sure they can't get it and live to fight another down. First and goal, and you throw the pick, not good at all. So the completion results there in nine yards. And it'll bring up a second and short. Throwing now is Allen. Man open here is Crowder. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. They'll run on first down with Singletary. And he's going to take this ahead for right around three yards, but no more than that. Second down. Right back to Singletary on second down. They had three yards on first down, just one yard there. They are in need of six yards here if they hope to move the chains. Throwing his Allen on third. He throws there incomplete. Now that's a good bounce back after giving up a touchdown on the opening drive. Just one first down permitted and then out. Obviously no loss of confidence with that defense. And now they get to turn it back to their offense. Allen will look to throw for it on fourth. He's got it complete to Stephon Diggs. Now the Bills are going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. Throwing on first down is Allen. That's going to be caught. Touchdown. Stephon Diggs, 26 yards. And the Bills will extend their lead in the final minute of the half. Extra point by Bass, up and good. And it's now 14 to nothing. the Bills kickoff unit now as they will send this one away. And Rodgers will hold on to this one and it will come out to the 25. Thank <laughs> you. 
The Colts come to the line ready to start their next drive. And with him down two scores, you wonder if they might try and put something together, even if it's just to get into field goal. And yet again, Ryan is intercepted. And he is going to score. It's a pick six and a Bills touchdown. Wow, this one, it is getting out of hand early. They add a pick six to the ledger now. Three score lead still in the first half. And all that celebrating that you see and hear from those defenders, it's not just because they scored a touchdown on a pick six. It's because they're pitching a shutout in this one. Every defender's dream. An extra point by Bass. Up and good. And that makes the score 21 to zip. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. This fielded right at the goal line. And he's up past the 20 to the 22-yard line. The Colts come to the line ready to start their next drive. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. Quarterbacks work all the time on manipulating a defense with their eyes and their head movement. In this case, he just stared the receiver down. That allowed for excellent coverage, able to knock that one away. So after the incompletion on first, now second and ten. Here's Ryan to throw. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. And he is going to score. It's a pick six and a Bills touchdown. 